you, Chris? That is, yeah, that's me in caricature mode. No. <laughs> you notice the pair on the, I love the pair on the computer. Oh, yeah. Time, it's time for the adventure. <laughs> Would everybody agree to go to slide number eight and go, let's go see if, do we want to see if let off is correct? Yeah. Yes, that's okay. good. So slide eight, and slide we're going to click on this. Yep. And delete. Yep. Okay. Okay. All right, so okay. back. We got that part right. <laughs> Yay. Oh, thank you for moving our card. Okay. Let off, offend. Oh, cause like offend? Is we should have maybe moved this word next to off. <laughs> Just to see what that next one was. Let off, let off. Off, offend, off end, offend, offend. And dear. So are these all like those goofy combos versus like, I really like what we have, but I don't know what to do with the other two, y'all. You want to check and see if lap is correct? Sure. And that would kind so of give us. Next slide. I mean, right. Michelle, are you good with checking? I am totally fine with that. And we want to look at this one, correct? Sure. Yep. Where did my delete go? Delete, 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 delete. Okay. Uh, we're just about to go into the puzzles with your group. You're going to go back in and work. But let's explain how the help cards work. The help cards are these little, how about my animation? The help oh, nice. Cards little, but, I, but I gotta work on it, I gotta work on it. Are the little green cards at the bottom. And using help cards, basically when you work on a puzzle, your resources are your group. Anytime you go outside of your group, so the minds of your group, when you go outside of your group, that requires a help card, right? If your group chooses to use a help card in the ways I'm going to show you, you first have to move the help card from one place to another. Um, let loose makes sense. I would say overbite makes sense. Yeah. Or, yeah, overbite. But overcoat makes sense too. Yes. Bite, would it be bite plate? Oh, sure. I thought it was branch. <laughs> Tree branch. Do you have any leftover help cards? We've got like seven of them. <laughs> Do we want to look at what comes after branch? <laughs> Sure, why not? Okay. Cannon. Uh, is a cannon jack a tool? Having not worked with cannons, I'm not positive, but. No idea. Sorry. Um, sure. <laughs> yeah, you're going you're gonna to be mad at me about this one. <laughs> why? Do you deserve it? No, I, it's a viable combination, um, but it's yeah. something I'd never heard of before. Probably the, they only use this term probably in the 1800s. Okay. We want to look at what comes after canon. Sure. Uh, for just a second, Jeremy, I even want to tell you what I thought your thing said, anonymous blobfish. <laughs> I just, yeah. I'm jealous that Jeremy gets to be the blobfish. Oh. <laughs> that's the first time I've seen that one come up. Yeah, that's funny. But you know, I'll be a goose. That's all right. Hey, I'll mind. So where do those come from? Is that something that the Google Doc just puts yeah, on Google, there? Yeah, Google does that. So they mm -hmm. just assign everybody every it always starts with anonymous and then and then it, they assign an animal. So mm -hmm. 